Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I am financial planner, Canna Campbell. So today's video is a capsule wardrobe video. I'm gonna share with you the top 10 favorite items within my wardrobe that I wear all the time. These are my go-to, my blue chip investment staples within my wardrobe. I wear them throughout the year. They're really classic and these key pieces allow me to maximize my wardrobe. I can style and wear them and team them up with other items within my wardrobe to really, I guess, lengthen the use and the range that my wardrobe goes. Now, because of these staple pieces, it means I don't need to buy as many items. I can make the most of what I've got. And because of the savings, it means more money for my share portfolio. Now, as I said, some of these items are old. Some of these are reasonably new, but I always make sure that I invest in quality items, items that make me feel good, are comfortable on the skin, are really well made, and of course, match my color palette, which is always beige, pink, blue, white, black and gray beige sometimes. So as I talk you through each piece, I'm gonna share with you obviously where I bought it from and the story behind it, but I'm also gonna share with you how I style that particular item to wear it in a variety of different ways. And I'm gonna be using all 10 items to create as many looks as possible because I really believe before you go shopping, you should really shop your own wardrobe and actually play dress up within your wardrobe because quite often we head to the shops to just go and buy items we already own, which you don't need to do and of course is a waste of money. All right, enough talking about this. Let me now show you my top 10 staple investments for my capsule wardrobe. All right, first up is this Balenciaga top. Now, before you think, oh my gosh, Balenciaga, that would have been expensive. No, I bought this pre-loved. I've been buying pre-loved before it became fashionable. In fact, some of the people I know used to make fun of me for buying pre-loved, and now it's really fashionable. I can't remember exactly where I bought this, uh, but it is incredibly comfortable. It meets my needs of it being, as I said, comfortable, a really classic cut round neckline. It's a high-end looking fabric. It's kind of like that tweed Chanel fabric. And of course, it follows my color palette, light pink with actually weaves of my other staple colors. So this is great. I can wear it with white. I can wear it with denim. I can wear it with black. I can wear it with cream. I can wear it with beige. Absolutely everything. It's a fantastic piece that gets worn all the time and I can dress it up and dress it down. Item number two are my frame denim boyfriend jeans. Now, whenever I wear these on my Instagram account at Canna Campbell Official, I get so many questions asking for me where I got these. Now, as I said, these are frame denim. These are really expensive at the time and I almost sent them back. But you guys actually suggested a few different ways as to how to style them and I style them that way and they work and I live in these. So whilst they were, I think about $260, which I think is a lot for a pair of jeans, uh, my cost per wear would probably be down to about 30 cents each wear. And these go in the wash all the time. I'm constantly dropping and spilling things on me, particularly with three kids. So these have been washed so many times and they still look fantastic. In fact, with a good pair of jeans, you can wear them and wash them so many times. They, you feel, seem to fall in love with them each time you wear them. So these are like a second glove to me. Now again, these are really great piece to have because I can dress them up and dress them down. I can style these with a pair of beige shoes if I want a bit of a sexy look with a silk top or a, a, maybe a camisole or I can use these with with sneakers or thongs for running around with the kids with a basic t-shirt but really comfortable really classic really well made and part of my color palette number three is my Scanlon and Theodore Angora cardigan now I own this in navy blue which I bought Oh, eight years ago and they bought this out again last year and Tom bought this for me for my birthday. I love it. Again, it's really well made. It's soft and fluffy. There's nothing worse than buying something that makes your skin itch because no matter how beautiful it is, you're not going to wear it. You're actually going to get an itch just looking at it in your wardrobe and it's a waste of money. These are great. Last year they did them in a variety of different colors. I think like six different colors and they sold really quickly. But this is such a great piece. I will wear this over a dress. I will wear this over a short mini skirt. I will wear this over my uh, boyfriend denim jeans. It's incredibly warm, but also it breathes really well. This is why I'm all about investing in quality over quantity. And the other great thing is I can style this in different ways. Quite often I'll wrap it around me and put a belt if I wanted a more sort of structured, chic, elegant look. Or I can just have it hanging off my shoulders if I want a more casual, easygoing look. And the great things about these is 
When you've got kids, they just love to absolutely snuggle up and cuddle you inside of these. It's like a little cocoon. Item number four, and this is, oh, it'd be nine and a half years old. It's a Zara pleather, because it's vegan, jacket. Now, I think I bought, spent about two or $300 at the time. I remember this being really expensive to me. And I actually took my girlfriend with me into the store to show her before I bought it. Because I just was, I was really nervous about making this purchase. Now, I would never give this away. I would never sell it. It is such a great piece. And it proves to you when you take care of your items and you buy something you really love, you do not need to go and replace it and buy multiple leather or pleather jackets. Now, again, this is a really versatile piece. I will wear this with a black chic cocktail dress over my shoulders with the neck up. I will also wear it with just denim and sneakers. I will wear this over a mini skirt. There's pretty much nothing that I will not wear this with. I absolutely love it. And this proves to you, you don't necessarily need to buy something expensive to get good quality. Item number five is classic crew neck jumpers. Now this one is from Lily Silk and I have quite a few jumpers from Lily Silk. They make really reasonably priced uh, knitwear particularly cashmere and I will I will admit I prefer to pay for a little bit more to have cashmere because it does breathe so much better and it is great against the skin. Having said that though I live in their cotton collection. Really classic simple round neck fitted. It kind of makes me feel like a ballerina when I wear this because it just fits in all the right places and kind of makes you want to sit up straight and embrace the, the chic elegant look of this. Really versatile piece. I will wear this with simple jeans and I will tuck it all the way in if I want a really neat classic elegant look or I'll throw it over my shoulders if I'm wearing like a skirt or some shorts I really can dress this up and dress this down another great thing about a classic jumper like this is you can team it with jewelry to completely transform the look you can wear it with very simple delicate pieces or you can really elevate that look if you want a more dramatic appeal with such a classic look and add like a heavy statement necklace or some big earrings or perhaps even a brooch. But this is one classic jumper that I will always own multiple of and they always get worn so much. So for me, it's well worth the investment. Item number six is my Chanel handbag. Now, I bought this for myself as a reward for achieving one of my financial goals and it is pre-loved. I bought it from the Purse Affair in Melbourne. I will link in the video description box their Instagram account because it is amazing. I really wanted this and I looked for so long. I saved up before I purchased it and it has been such a great piece. And for me right now, I love to wear crossbodies. I have two young girls. I need to be able to run and catch them and carry them all the time. But I also want to make sure that I can have my mobile phone, dummies and anything else that I might need that's not too bulky. So this is a fantastic piece to wear as a cross the body piece. Now, also the great thing about these handbags is you can actually put the straps inside and carry it around as a clutch or simply over the shoulder if I want to use this for more of an elegant nighttime look with that cocktail dress. But I am so happy with this purchase. It was an expensive purchase, so I was really nervous at the time, but it has definitely been a fantastic purchase for me and one that I use all the time. Again, my cost per wear is still quite high because it is obviously a Chanel, but it's coming down every day and I absolutely love value use and appreciate this one. Item number seven is classic well-made t-shirts. Now, I used to buy my t-shirts from H&M, their Conscious Ethical Collection. These were really good. They were thick, they were really well made, they had the nice round neckline, the nice capped shoulders, but they stopped making them and I have ne was never able to find them. However, I was chatting with Jamie from Mademoiselle Jamie and she mentioned these and I went into the, uh, into the Uniqlo store, I picked up three of them, this color, black and white. They were really reasonably priced, they wash really well. Again, I wear these all the time because they're just such classic pieces and they, they make them in such fantastic shades as well. So these are pretty much my go-to and I would wear these, I think, five days per week. And as I said, they've got a fantastic range, definitely worth checking out and extremely budget friendly. Item number eight, and these pair of jeans would rival my frame denim jeans, uh, but they are probably about one third of the price, you'd be pleased to hear. I will admit these were a gift um, by Myers. I went to one of their events. It's the wedgie straight leg. So they have the ripped, distressed look, 
Uh, they're not a style I would never ever actually go and buy, but they gave them to me and then I tried them on and I've been wearing them ever since. It's kind of nice to just change up your look a little bit because I used to always just gravitate towards skinny jeans. But I love them. It's comfortable, it's chic, it's a bit a little bit young and edgy still with the, the distressed hem and knee. But again, it goes with absolutely everything in my wardrobe and of course it follows my capsule colour palette. Now again, Levi's make an amazing collection of jeans in so many different cuts and in so many different colours. And they're really well made and they're extremely budget friendly, especially when you compare them against the luxury designer denim. Item number nine and this is eight and a half years old. I bought this when Rocco was a newborn baby and he's about to turn nine. So this is a Scanlon and Theodore skirt. Scanlon and Theodore is something that I have a lot of it in my wardrobe, but they are expensive, but they are incredibly well made and very classic cuts. They stand the test of time, they wash well, they dry clean well, and their cuts are incredibly versatile and you can dress them up and dress them down in certain different ways. So whilst they do sometimes push my budget, I know that it's going to be a long-term investment and I'm going to get my dollars per wear. So this is their Scort. It's a cross between a skirt and a pair of shorts. So front on they actually look like a pair of shorts but actually in reality is they're a skirt. But the thing about this is it just, they just fit right. They grab me in all the right places. Lightly on the hips, slightly down, darted out like an A-line so it does accentuate the shape of my legs and hides the parts that I don't really feel like showing. But again this has been a really classic investment. I can wear this with any of my tops in the wardrobe to create a whole range of different looks. I can change the shoes really easily and take, transform it from a casual daytime look to a chic, elegant, cute nighttime look. And again really great fabric, really good stitching, really good workmanship well worth the investment for me which is why it's eight and a half almost nine years old and then the final piece within my wardrobe has got to be my Everlane mini denim skirt it's part of my capsule color palette collection it sits in all the right places they're really well made and again another piece that gets thrown in the wash every week and still comes out looking brand new I can pretty much wear this just like the black skirt with every single top in my wardrobe to create a whole range of different looks and it always feels comfortable. It's never itchy or too tight or grabbing me in all the wrong places. It just works. Now, as I've been talking, I've been sharing with you a whole range of different ways of styling each of these clothes and how I put them together and have fun. Before you head to the shops, I highly recommend investing some time playing in your own wardrobe, getting to understand, learn your own style, how you want to show up in the world, how you want to get dressed, what makes you feel comfortable both inside and outside, and learn to honor the act of getting dressed because it makes you feel good inside and that's only going to shine out to everyone else. And of course, whenever you go shopping, follow my shopping mantra, only buy what you love, value, use, and appreciate. All right, everyone, thank you so much for watching. Of course, check out the links below if you're interested in any of the items that I have bought. And let me know if you want more videos like this by commenting below. And also, let me know which of the items, the 10 items, is your favorite piece. All right, that's enough from me. I will see you next Thursday for more videos on Sugar Mama TV. So make sure you are subscribed. Ciao.